Oh, it's insane. Uh, I was being like, just even being on the sidelines, filling the waters, seeing the guys run out and just hearing a roar. I mean, uh, uh, like it was something I've never seen before, I guess. Like, I mean, you hear that at the Arrows games with so, with the fans, but uh, there's only 5,000 or so, but hearing what, 25,000 people just scream for the boys and, and they're playing the drums and everything. It was, it was awesome. It was a great experience. I know the team has really got into um, things from a cultural standpoint. What, uh, what has it, your highlight been um, you know, off the pitch so far uh, from being in Japan? I think just embracing everything that we've seen. I mean, Canada and Japan are very culturally different. Um, uh, we got to harvest rice, uh, which is very cool. We got to uh, cook chicken in a Japanese traditional way. I mean, just, I think, um, comparing sort of uh, Canada's culture to Japan is very interesting and it's it's been very enjoyable. And now the focus shifts to the All Blacks game. What's the mindset going to be uh, heading into that next match against New Zealand? Oh, we're just we're just going to give them their uh, our all. Um, we're going to make sure that they know that they played uh, the Canadian team. We're going to go hard. Uh, got a couple things to fix up, uh, but the boys are, are working hard on an off day uh, to figure out what those things are. We're going to put it into uh, practice make sure we're right and accurate.